It may have arrived under cover of darkness, but there was nothing mysterious about the way Port Talbot's most famous artwork left town today. It took a team of engineers and lots of expensive kits, more than half a day, to send it on its way. We're now drawing the, the piece out. Uh, that would be drawn out by a forklift, moving that platform forward to another stage. At that point, a transporter will arrive, will arrive and a crane, and it'll be lifted on a low loader and take it to a, an undisclosed place. It was three years ago that the mural entitled Seasons Greetings appeared overnight on this backstreet garage. It was bought by a private owner who agreed to house it in the town for three years. But now that time's up and it's on the move again. No one knows where exactly, but it won't be local. So Seasons Greetings says goodbye. Made in Wales, meant to be shown in Wales. Now destined for display in England. The owner says his idea for a street art museum to house Seasons Greetings in Port Talbot was rejected. It's a shame, I suppose, because a lot of people here would say that this message is very relevant to Port Talbot, and it's a shame that the artwork is now going. Yes, it is. And I, I mean, as I say, I nearly put myself in hospital fighting the local establishment. But the, I think that the bigger thing is more important, and the bigger thing is, he, yes, he did it here in Port Talbot because the pollution is so bad, but what I think is important is that the pollution is global. The project's backers say the long-term ambition is to put the Banksy back where it belongs, in the public gaze. He does them on the street because he wants everyone to have access to them and to be able to see them. So we are really passionate about restoring this work of art back to the people. Those people on the outside looking in today, after a three-year saga, many sad to see this piece of local history disappear. They've lost out on a, I don't know, a big tourist thing, really, to get people in. It's very sad for Port Talbot. It's very sad for fans of Banksy. It's very sad for street art. Neath Port Talbot Council says it's grateful so many people had the chance to see Season's Greetings. But for now, the future of this modern masterpiece lies elsewhere. Richard Morgan, ITV News, in Port Talbot.